the campaign trail. The party leaders hit the road for week two. The voters' voice. Canadians have their say on the election so far. Faith on parade. Hindus take to the streets to celebrate. Sunday Report with Alison Smith. Good evening. The leaders of Canada's main parties are on the move tonight, heading out for the start of week two. Most of them took a breather today. All in all, a pretty calm day. But the calm before what promises to be a storm of electioneering. Jean Chrétien headed out of Ottawa tonight for Toronto. Later this week, the Liberals will unveil their full platform. The leader wasn't talking to reporters today, but, but Paul Martin was. I'll tell you that never there has there been an election in the history of this country, uh, certainly that I have seen, when the line in the sand has been drawn as clearly as it has been between the Liberal vision and the Alliance vision. He was meeting and greeting people in Dartmouth, Nova Scotia. New Democratic Party leader Alexa McDonough working out some details before boarding a flight in Ottawa before a big day tomorrow. We're going to be uh, unveiling our platform. We worked very hard on it for many, many months and uh, we feel really good about it. McDonough will release that platform in Toronto. Conservative leader Joe Clark was rallying the troops today at party headquarters in Ottawa. We're the little train that can. <laughs> Clark is campaigning in Quebec tomorrow. And some hijinks from the Alliance campaign plane last night. Stockwell Day taking friendly aim at reporters with his RCMP bodyguards backing him up. Day was off today. It's back to the more usual style of campaign fight tomorrow for a swing through some Ontario ridings.